This is the terrifying moment Jude Jivan fell into a blaze deliberately started by arsonists in his Liverpool newsagents. 48-year-old Mr Jivan, a Sri Lankan who owns Robinson's News on Priory Road in Amfield, spoke today for the first time about what happened. I can't remember that when I saw the footage on the today I was shocked really, completely shocked. So you don't recall what happened? No, I know I know I, I fell on the pe uh, petrol and the hand was fire. But I can't remember the f fire on me completely. I saw it when I saw the uh, footage only I knew it was it shocked me. It was completely shocked. Right arm completely burned, uh, and the smoke went to the inside, and my throat. I can't spoke nearly, th nearly two, three weeks in the hospital. I mean, two weeks in the hospital. Nearly three, four weeks take me to come back in a normal voice. This was it was hurting. Personally, I'm thinking this is not a racist attack at all. Do you think there's any motive? I don't know. I can't understand. I, can't, I, I just want to find out why this happened to me. That's how I want to know. Philip Seary, who was asleep in the flat above the shop, was also put at risk by the reckless actions of the arsonists. The shop was extensively damaged, as was the flat upstairs, but Jude plans to open a shop today in a premises next door. Especially community behind me. That's why I do, I'm a little bit uh, panic and afraid, but I know the community going to guard me or something like that. Anyone who knows the man is urged to contact Merseyside Police. This is John Sutton for LiverpoolEcho.co.uk.